guys, all of us are now in quarantine and sitting at home. And uh, what's the main word which you're gonna hear from any TV, live show, that's wash your hands. And you know, guys, I love this country. I am passionate about this country and about medicine. But only one thing which really surprised anybody who came uh, to United States from uh, Soviet Union. Guys, what are you doing? When we saw all these doctors, uh, nurses on a street, when they waiting public transportation already in his work uniform, it looks crazy. Yes, you wash your hands, but you bring like tons of microbes and viruses on your clothes from public transportation to work. Guys, you seriously crazy? And right now the story about the same kind of craziness about this weekend. For example, a lot of Americans uh, do not care how clean they cars. Really don't care, guys. Really, your cars looks like sometimes like too dirty. Not all of them, but I understand the cars in the United States is cheap. It's not like like big deal like in Ukraine in the Soviet Union the price for the car, and you don't care of them. And you put a lot of trash inside the car, and especially it's trash from your Dunkin' Donuts, McDonald's, all these plastic bags, plastic cups, and uh, other stuff. And for example, what's happened with this vehicle with Ford Transit? One of your passengers, which next to you, complains that his butt is overheated, or his <laughs> melted, and you have like like kind of like <laughs> fried eggs inside your car. You know what's the reason? Because you need to clean your cars more often. Because all these plastic bags, all these cups, get under this seat where installed heater fan, and this fan works like vacuum cleaner. He get air from your interior and put them uh, from all like vents. Uh, on the back of the car. And when it's stuck with all these plastic bags with your cups, it get overheated. Guys, if you wanna fix your problem with your heater or because your butt is overheated on this fan, because fan overheated on this, this is, please clean your cars more often and then we're gonna fight coronavirus.